Hey, welcome to the Ranger Rob channel with Rob and Sherry. This video is made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available on Amazon right now. Well, good morning everyone. This is Ranger Rob at Central Oregon Living and Homestead. And, uh, ooh, did I see here? It's a kitty. Hi, kitty. Well, she's happy to be outside. And, uh, she's pretty good about sticking around the house, so we don't let her out a lot. But today is a big day. Because today, the chickens get to, uh, move into their new house. And so, uh, Sherry, oh, here comes the, I'm going to release the Krakens here. Hi, guys. How are you? Hey, sit, Belle. Belle, what you doing? <laughs> She's not camera shy. So, uh, Sherry got up early. Made me look bad. Went out and touched up the... Ah! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Went up and, uh... I know, I screamed like a little girl there. I uh, touched up the, uh, chicken coop out there. Um, so, uh, I told her, why didn't she wash the cars, too, while she was up? But, uh, anyway... So uh, today, I'm going to check on the chickens this morning, make sure they're all doing all right this morning for their big day. And uh, let's go see how they're doing. So yeah, it's dark in here in the barn. I hear some peeping going on. Look at that. You guys ready to see your new house? So, uh, let me get these guys watered and fed, and then we get some, uh, a uh, couple little things to do on the chicken pen, put some, uh, hay in there, and then we'll show you releasing them into their new home. Well, guys, we're, uh, just about ready. I just got to pick up a few tools in here. We did block off the two, uh, nesting boxes. We're going to clean up a little bit. Sherry is on her way here with the tractor and some plywood and we're going to store our hay underneath this so uh, we're going to lay some blocks down put a piece of plywood and that's where we're going to keep our our hay for now until uh, we have something better but uh, we're getting close to putting the babies in and here comes our piece of wood our hay and some scrap wood that's underneath the hay on our very slow little tractor, the Kubota. And uh, we'll probably just bring it right over here and uh, unload it. And then we'll start making this chicken coop look like a chicken coop. Okay, so the house is ready. Got our hay down below and uh, added hay to the main cage here. We're going to let them spread it out and have some fun. And uh, yeah, we're about ready to put the babies in. All right, the day of reckoning has finally come. The baby chickens are out here. We're ready to put them in. I'm going to release them right now. Once again, these are baby Rhode Island Red. There are 10 of them. We've got their hay for them to spread out. I've got, a, these are temporary water and feeders right now. Their little house is ready for them. So let's release the chickens.
floor in there. They're holding on for dear life. Come on out. I got one that will not come out. Come on out. No, Cinder. Cinder, stop. Bell, no. Cinder, no. Good girl. You can't chase the babies. Cinder, come. No, sit, sit. Cinder, stay here. Good girl, stay. So, uh, the chickens must be pretty confused. They've lived in a can all their lives, basically. And, uh, of course, our dogs are confused, too. They've never really got to see the chickens. They've heard them, and they've licked over the top. But So this is uh, training time for two dogs, especially this, this little girl. And the chickens are staying together. They're definitely... Not sure what to think of all this, but I'm sure their natural instincts will kick in. We put the food close to the entrance of the uh, house. Tonight we'll shush them up to the house, let them stay in there. They have not had a heat lamp for five days, and you can see they feathered out very well. And so uh, now Cinder. it's just come on, Cinder. Now it's kind of cute to just watch them uh, look at their new world. So. Uh, Day one, guys. We're pretty happy. So it's been uh, quite interesting. We've been sitting here watching for a while. Dogs are definitely having a hard time getting used to them. Um, the young German Shepherd, she barks a little bit. But the chickens are actually pretty calm. But we're going to go in, go feed the dogs, go in the house a little bit, let the uh, chickens just explore without people around. I'm sure they're overwhelmed. But hey, uh, we're pretty excited pretty excited uh, this was day one all the work that we've been doing for these ten little chickens so uh, we've still got a few things to do better water systems and things like that but uh, this will get them started so hey I want to thank everybody for watching we've got so many other projects going on I, I believe in the future we got a compost bin that we're building and then uh, we also got to start digging the garden out uh, get it ready for uh, uh, just kind of rejuvenating the ground a little bit and then we're gonna uh, put uh, plastic over it for the winter we got so much work to do it's not even funny but hey thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe please share our videos right now share it to anybody who might be interested in uh, following our story joining our family please feel free to leave your comments uh, I'd love to hear from you uh, always be polite. We appreciate it, <coughs> uh, as we will be, too. And uh, have a great day, everybody. Bye now. 
Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.